What if the future weren't years ahead, but right in front of you? China didn't just host tech at Canton Fair 2025. China unleashed a robotics renaissance at Canton Fair 2025. From emotion detecting humanoids to service robots powered by AI created to do actual jobs, this is no science fiction. It's happening today. These robots walk and talk and think and feel. Some of them are guiding our guests. Some are dancing. Some are picking up 50 kilos as if they are weightless. This season's lineup wasn't impressive. It created history. Buckle up and witness the brightest, the coolest, and the most advanced robots built yet. Among the latest developments in robotics and artificial intelligence was Naya, a bionic interactive robot specifically created to interact with forum attendees. Welcome visitors, say hello to them, and provide services, all in a chipper tone and remarkably human-like facial expressions. Nia wasn't just reactive, she was charming. Nia and her colleagues boast advanced facial motor capabilities, accurate speech recognition, and intelligent decision-making software, enabling them to have dynamic dialogue, real-time understanding, and extremely natural looking responses to words and body language. Naya doesn't just speak, she communicates. Her body positioning, direction of attention, and facial expression make her smile, take an interest, nod to confirm and express surprise. She can wave goodbye, thumb up, say goodbye, or even handshake through fluid looking bodily motion. Her visit to the forum wasn't a demos only event, it was a preview of the ways robots can embed themselves in the social scene and offer beneficial and meaningful interaction. From schools and public services to companions and entertainment kiosks, Nia's flexibility has numerous potential uses. She is no face on a robot. She is a face-bearing robot, and her face altered the way people think about AI and where it will fit into everyday life. Chinese female robots Ching Bao, created by the Chinese robotics company Shanghai Robot Engine, stunned the crowds again with their elegant movements and striking appearances. The robots have been featured at China's largest exhibitions for years, and this event proved no exception. The robots created by the company are able to carry out many functions from interaction with humans to providing information and taking part in activities. Their design and ability make them fit perfectly to work as customer service assistants, educational domains, and entertainment domains. The robots have built-in sensor and artificial intelligence technologies that enable them to participate in truly natural dialogue and respond naturally to their surroundings. One of the world's loveliest robots, Amira, reappeared in public view this month. Engineered Arts, a London robotics company famous for creating the world's most realistic humanoid robots, created her. Amira sports a deeply realistic human face with delicate texture and soft facial expression and feature. Her skin, crafted out of top-of-the-line silicone, possesses a silky softness and finish capable of coming close to matching the texture and gloss of real skin naturalness is aided by the handiwork of facial design. Cheeks, lips, brows, and jawline carefully crafted so she can smoothly shift from emotion to emotion. Her expression system enables her to smile up warmly, raise her eyebrow at the moment of surprise and wonder, express curiosity via eye-tracking motion, and also shift from smiling face to sorrowful face via delicate mouth and eye movements. Amira doesn't just mimic emotion, she sends it for depth and timing and a lifelike quality to her being. Amira can carry out interactive chat through pre-storied lines via software and sophisticated speech synthesis software. Amira carries high sensitivity microphones and speech recognition software so she can interpret spoken input and render verbal replies of corresponding tone and gesture. More than a robot created to look human, she's created to engage emotionally. MagicBot is currently being displayed. These next-gen androids navigate through complex spaces easily with full awareness and flexibility. Equipped with light detection and ranging, LiDAR, RGBD cameras, three RGB cameras, and ultrasonic sensors that permit seeing in depth, obstacle avoidance, and gliding through dense spaces smoothly. Magic Lab also created a rough terrain navigation system for MagicBot, so it glides easily both indoors and out. The bot can carry 40 kilograms of weight capacity 
and 42 degrees of freedom in total for advanced locomotion and picking up objects up to a weight limit of 20 kilograms. Even in arduous conditions too, it glides smoothly for 5 hours using a solitary battery. The performance of the humanoid improved greatly. It displays accurate hand manipulation, synchronized walk, and smooth multi-joint motion, all while not compromising stability and agility. Magic Bot adapts well to a change in environments and does work the same way a human will. The show-stopping human-like robot at Canton Fair 2025, Booster T1, was a pint-sized and expressive marvel built to reinvent human-tech interaction. This new generation robot wasn't just programmed to walk and talk, he was built to understand and engage on a human scale. We visitors were immediately entranced by his lifelike walk, emotive speech, and unexpectedly witty and well-timed sense of humor. Booster T1 greeted crowds with a warm hello, offered directions politely with deferential gestures and responded naturally with nods and nods and nods. Even the ability to track gazes and adjust tone mid-sentence and the ability to mirror emotions of people around him was feasible to him. According to researchers, Booster T1 houses dynamic muscle actuators, high-powered artificial intelligence able to carry on a great chat, and emotion mapping sensors to enable him to respond sympathetically, curiously, or humorously according to the situation. His applications extend from public reception and customized customer service through interactive entertainment. His waving, bowing, and smooth gesturing could be done as easily as his creating a laughter completely naturally. His selfies ensued readily enough, and at a later point he led a small group through a synchronized dance routine to be cheered and whooped over by the passers-by. Deep Robotics robotic dog Light 3 was taken to the Canton Fair by the company. While it did its level best to please passersby with any and every trick it knew, people were much more interested in the release of the new Lynx M20, the current quadruped line. This model appears significantly more beefed up from its predecessors and carries a cachet as the world's first wheeled industrial robot capable of being used in harsh environments. From what we've seen so far on video, the device is pretty much all terrain and extremely agile. Among the device's attributes stand out are bi-directional lights, more intended to assist human operators than the device itself, which rely upon a 360 degree lidar. The device can cover spaces as narrow as 50 centimeter gaps between objects, climb over obstructions up to 80 centimeter high, and navigate stairs. Noting the device has a top speed of 18 km per hour and can move over a 45 degree incline. The weatherproof device holds the IP66 rating and can operate at minus 20 degree Celsius Celsius or plus 55 degrees Celsius temperature rates. The device can handle 15 kilogram loads and weighs 33 kilogram and the battery. Magic Lab Magic Lab returned to the fair with its humanoid robots. The startup premiered exactly a year ago with a humanoid robot and a robotic dog. As part of its 10-year anniversary celebration, China's Fourier Robotics unveiled a groundbreaking innovation in humanoid robotics. Centering its launch will be GR1, a humanoid robot developed after years of focused research and development. GR1 has 40 degrees of freedom, giving it unprecedented mobility and agility. Its structure is powered by high-performance actuators that allow it to achieve a steady pace, execute synchronized motions, and grasp tools mechanistically with precision. The bot can travel at up 5 km per hour and carry up to 50 kilogram and is thereby the most physically capable service bot in its category. But GR1 is more than a strong frame. It's intelligent. It's outfitted with an artificial intelligence system with the capability to make real-time decisions using software, high fidelity voice recognition, and an emotional interaction module. This allows GR1 to identify commands, interpret people's voices and habits, and respond with as considerate and contextualized as feasible. Aside from launching the GR1, Fourier also unveiled a successor model, the GR2. The 1.75 meter tall and 63 kilogram GR2 comes equipped with additional mechanisms with 53 degrees of freedom for even more fluid motion. The model also comes with a removable battery for extended uptime and improved object management systems to reuse tasks more widely. GR2 assures complex utilization from logistics to advanced customer facing use, and its breakthroughs represent the big leap towards enabling an intelligent full-body robots. 
Agibot unveiled a groundbreaking humanoid robot training facility in Beijing's Jinshan district. The specialized facility is the first in China where robots are trained in fully realistic human-like environments before being deployed in the real world. The facility is divided into two areas. In the first area, the humanoid robots learn the fundamentals in a way similar to early childhood growth. Here they learn the fundamentals of locomotion and interaction with the physical world and people and become socially responsive to their environments. They learn Learn navigation in rooms and picking objects up, object recognition and detection, and sensitivity to being close to human beings. The second area is where the robots are trained for professional undertakings. The robots are trained in addressing complex tasks such as reception work in a hotel, janitorial work, and warehouse work. These robots are not programmed, they are conditioned in simulated and real environments of living and working. Every part of the living and working spaces in the training facility was carefully built to mimic actual living and working environments. Kitchens and living rooms, balconies and hotel lobbies, the storerooms and the imitation farms, every corner of the ambience provide a milieu where robots can train and acclimatize the way they cannot otherwise train or acclimatize in laboratory settings alone. Padbot introduced its robotic platform for modern buildings. These service robots do more than achieve tasks, but also become a part of human environments in a seamless way. The portfolio includes robots used for welcoming guests, delivering items, guarding spaces, and entertaining humans in a charming and engaging way. The X3 model is the flagship model and is the autonomous reception robot. It welcomes guests, gives instructions, and guides them through buildings all by itself without the need for the intervention of a human being. Navigation software and sensors enable X3 to detect the approach of people and engage them as and when required and speak naturals. The W2 delivery bot is equally efficient too, making secure and self-assured transitions between floors, elevators, and corridors, and at speedy speeds moving packages safely. The robotic form facilitates stability amidst busy or even narrow spaces. For entertainment purposes, Padbot hired the services of P3 that draws attention through dance steps and emotive body gestures. Its rhythmic style creates a scenario to entertain crowds or chat in game activities with kids. The T2 model focuses on educational interaction. It accompanies and guides kids through interactive study sessions, through voice recognition, interpretive animation, and interactive storytelling. Alpha robots showcase their advanced service robots at the fair, and not just as delivery robots, but also as super smart support staff for business environments. The company is no greenhorn. It holds over 300 patents and four research and development labs and sells products to 75 nations. Its years of robotics design have given it international recognition. Their flagship products include Timo, a multi-language greeting robot, and Panda, a crowd-savvy delivery robot. Timo speaks 40 languages and can service clients clients, answer research requests, and define the area in easy-to-understand words. Its facial display sports dynamic faces, giving the experience a personal and natural touch. Panda is built for high-performance operation in dynamic public spaces. Its LAR system, camera system, and robust body can push through packed spaces with confidence and ensure deliveries or supplies get through safely and promptly in time. It can alter routes mid-course and detect obstructions in real time. Alpha Robotics already has their products in the field across industries from hospitality and medical through retail and government agencies.